Good afternoon everyone, I'm Gary Martin and today you're joining me in a garage in Barnsley where I'm here to help my friend sell some of his second hand golf equipment because his missus is going absolutely crazy. He's just been to Vegas and he spent over three grand and they're getting, they're getting married this year. So I'm in Barnsley and we're, we're going to be clearing some of his old irons. We've got two iron here, we've got a few putters and uh, you know you're going to really help do me a favour and, and, and him a favour because... Uh, you know, we're in bother at the minute. I'll tag the video we did a few days ago with the, with the woods. There's still a few of them pieces left. And there's some absolute bargains in, this, in there. So make sure you watch that one. We're going to start off. We've got a set of Callaway. Callaway. Do you know what? I haven't recovered from jet lag, guys. It's first time I've got... I've been to America, obviously, to, to Vegas. And I just thought jet lag was some sort of you know, way of sort of getting a few extra days off work. It's real. Believe me, it's real. I've not recovered. Uh, I'm still suffering with a bit of jet lag, saying some stupid things and uh, feeling sleepy. So we started with some Nike. I'll bring these ones in and show you. We've got some Nike. These are full cavities. They're really deep cavities. So what is a deep cavity? They've got, well, they've got really wide soles, so they're going to interact well with the floor. The deep cavity is going to help create backspin and launch, get the ball up in the air. So these are going to be good for somebody that, you know, struggles to launch the ball in the air. Maybe wants some confidence, you know, the massive chunky heads of these. We've got a free iron to, to pitching wedge. You don't get many long guys like that in, in the modern day set. So we've got, is that eight irons? It is, it's eight irons. We've got some regular steel shafts in there, standard grips. Condition wise, you know, no major marks, just normal use. Seven out of ten. We're going to go 150 delivered on them one, guys. Uh, if you are international, I, are, I will get you a price. It will be a little bit more to post them. But get in the comments, guys, if you're interested in them ones. Oh, this is juicy. This is an MP18 2-iron. It's an MMC Fly High. It's an absolute perler. Look at that one. It's barely been used. I reckon he's bought that, you know, without testing it. It's a Project X... It's a rifle 5.0 shaft with a, a multi-compound grip. It feels brand new. He's barely used it. He's bought this blind. I'll be having a word with him. We're going to put that one in at £100 delivered because that is an absolute perler. And uh, we need to get him some money back in bank. What we got here? Bloody hell. These are a bit of a mixed bag. We've got some G25 irons with a couple of wedges. So we've got 7 iron, 8 iron and 9 iron. And then we've got a, a pink, I better bring these in and show you. So we've got the G25, we've got the full cavity irons, but there's only three. There's a 789 iron. We've got a, a specialist 48 degree ping, sort of 48. So that, that's like a, a pitching wedge. And then we've got a tour 58, um, sort of tour wedge. So they're almost like, you could say they're like 7 iron to, seven iron to sand wedge, although the sand wedge is a 58, so it's more like a sand wedge slash lob wedge. They're all graphite shafts, regular graphite. Who would these suit? These would probably suit somebody just getting into golf, wants a set of irons, you know. If you're newer to golf, guys, don't worry about getting the longer irons. You know, 7 iron down, it'll be enough to get you going. You know, sometimes you can get the 5 and the 4 and not be able to hit them. You know, and they just cost you shots, so... Maybe someone getting into golf, maybe a senior, somebody slowing down with a swing, doesn't hit the longer irons anymore. Possibly a junior, a youth, you know, somebody that wants a, a lightweight set. Um, we're going to go £99 on them ones. You know, they're delivered £99. Ping, I think they'll hold the value pretty well, them ones as well. You know, such a good brand. Let's have a look at putters. We've got a few good, in fact, with these irons are... These are two sets of eyes here. I won't, I won't mind having a swing with myself, to be honest. But we're going to go putters. I've had a little look at this one. I've had a look at all putters. You know what I'm like with a putter. We've got a Radius Classic line. It's a Chester, which I would say, I mean, I'll show you this one. It's like a Newport design, isn't it? It's an absolute perler. I'll put some close-ups of this one in, actually. Um, it's a beautiful head. It's barely, you know, it's barely got a mark on it. It's black. It's 303, you know, stainless steel. So you know what, you know, any good putter's made from 303 stainless. It's got a Tor SNSR grip, you know, almost brand new, original cover. These bad boys, so we're selling at 299 brand new and still online, you know, the 250. 
uh, even to this day. We're going to stick that one in at 110 delivered. That's an absolute steal. For anybody wanting something a bit naughty, a bit rare, you know, not on the market anymore, but uh, a little bit of a, definitely a retro. Then we're going to go, oh, this is a this is quite a recent putter. Triple track, triple track 10. I'm sure James had one of these in the bag, actually. Um, that's a lovely looking club. No marks on that at all. It's got the uh, the Odyssey Stroke Lab grip on it and Stroke Lab shaft. So it's it's a, it's basically counterbalanced, guys. It's counterbalanced from the top. You know, added more weight up here. They've lost weight in the middle here, and then obviously got the mass of the the club. So it's it's a counterbalanced triple track ten. I can't give this one away too cheap. I know they've spent a lot of money. These were about two seven nine. I'm going to go 150 on that one delivered, which is an absolute bargain. Uh, I think there'll be a few people messaging about that one. And then, ooh, this is a bad boy. This is a yes putter. I used to love yes putters. I used to have a Tracy 2, and it were only until recently Matt Fitzpatrick took his out of the bag, weren't it? So, you know, we've got the yes C group technology, which I think is fantastic technology. You know, it gets that ball rolling without jumping. Uh, and I'm very surprised that we, that, you know, we don't see more of these on the market. This one's the Donner Sea Groove. It's got a, like a yellow, really funky yellow top line. It does help draw you in that. It does help draw you in to sort of taking it straight back and through. It's almost like an Odyssey 1W, one a one wide Odyssey, but with, you know, this extra additional alignment on it with a yellow Ionic grip. I had to have a look at the price of these because... Uh, you know, obviously, I weren't I weren't familiar with it. I've never actually seen one with this yellow sort of insert and and yellow top, but they're fetching big money, and uh, I'm gonna have to put that in there for him at ninety nine, just because it's becoming rare and sought after. Now, there's two sets of irons, guys. These are really worth waiting for. There's a set here which I used to play, and the apps. Believe me when I said the pearlers. It's for a set of this age. I've got to get them out of the bag first. We've got the Callaway X Tor Forged. These are like a mid sized cavity. There's not enough of these on market. You know, a mid sized iron that's aimed at a, an intermediate golfer that's forged. We all want that, don't we? We want forgiveness and we want a forged iron. Make more of these irons. I used to have these when I were a junior. They were absolutely fantastic. And these are pearlers. I don't know, they've barely been used. These were a gra over a grand a set. And this is going back years ago. The forged, you know, there's barely any face wear on these. I'm going to get really up close here. There's barely any face mark. Look at the condition of them. There's barely any bag clatter. I'm sure he's using the iron covers. They've got the rifle 6.0 shafts in them. Look at them, the rifles there. Eh? And then the grips. He's only had these recently gripped by the looks of things. MCC standard align multi compounds, and they feel fantastic. These are some hell of an iron. I'm going to go 250 on them delivered. Um, and somebody who appreciates a good oldie but goodie set is going to be well over the moon with them. What can you get for 249 these days, irons wise? Absolutely nothing. Right. This is probably one of the most popular sets of irons on the market at the minute. It's the P790. I believe. P790, I'm 95% sure, I can't be under, but I'm 95% sure, they're the 2019 model, it says 7198, it's got the toe stamp tailor made, and it just says tungsten here, you know, get in the comments guys, just correct me on that one if I'm wrong, the 5 iron to pitching wedge, with dynamic gold, S300 shafts in, and they've got the 2G wrap grips on, you know, very popular spec these, you know, stiff, dynamic goal, five to pitching wedge. I mean, let's be honest, guys, these are strong lofted. The five iron's going to play like a four. You know, you're probably going to need a gap wedge in this set. Um, we're going to go delivered. I've had a little bit of a look on price of these. We're going to go delivered. Five, two, five. That's very good, believe me, especially for this condition. They're absolute pearlers. Uh, remember, 2019, we're a time where we're in COVID. People weren't playing much golf, you know, we were shut down, we were locked down for like UK. 
So you can tell it reflects in the condition of these. Um, he just likes to change his clubs. So that brings us to the end of what's in the garage. And uh, what we're going to be doing now, guys, is if you're interested in the equipment, get in the comments. I'll respond if it's still available. And if it is, I'll put the payment details in there. You can ring me in the pro shop at Huddersfield or you can email me and uh, we'll hopefully get some of this stuff moved. I hope you've enjoyed that one, guys. You know, if it's the first time you've watched the videos, do like and subscribe. There's going to be a bit of playing stuff next week. We're going to be getting back out on the course. Hopefully, I've got over, um, I've got over the jet lag, and we'll be playing another top 100. So, uh, yeah, I'll see you next week. Bye.